Space is vast. It's bigger than big. It's bigger than anything we can really imagine. And it's full of mysteries. One of the biggest mysteries is how we might one day communicate with other civilizations out there. Could we send messages across the vast cosmic ocean, bridging the gaps between stars and galaxies? One intriguing possibility lies in the faint whispers of hydrogen, the most abundant element in the universe. Hydrogen is the building block of stars, and it emits a very specific radio wave that we can detect here on Earth. This radio wave, known as the hydrogen line, could hold the key to unlocking faster-than-light communication. Imagine a future where we send messages on the back of these cosmic whispers, our thoughts racing across the universe at speeds that defy our current understanding of physics. It's a future ripe with possibility, and it all starts with understanding the language of the cosmos. Hydrogen atoms are simple things, with just one proton and one electron. But their simplicity is also their strength. When the electron in a hydrogen atom flips its spin, it releases a tiny burst of energy in the form of a radio wave. This radio wave has a very specific frequency, 1420.4 megahertz, and it's known as the hydrogen line. The hydrogen line is important because it's ubiquitous. Wherever we find hydrogen in the universe, we find this faint radio signal. It's like a cosmic beacon broadcasting the presence of hydrogen across the vastness of space. Think of it like this. Imagine you're lost in a dense forest and you hear a faint cry for help. You don't know where the cry is coming from, but you know someone is out there. The hydrogen line is like that cry for help, a signal from the distant reaches of the universe telling us that hydrogen is out there. Astronomers use the hydrogen line to map the distribution of hydrogen in our galaxy and beyond. By pointing radio telescopes at different parts of the sky, they can detect the hydrogen line and create maps of where hydrogen is most abundant. These maps help us understand the structure of our galaxy, the Milky Way, and how it has evolved over billions of years. Imagine you're an explorer charting a new continent. You might use rivers and mountains as landmarks to create a map. Astronomers do something similar with the hydrogen line, using it as a cosmic landmark to map the Milky Way. These maps reveal the spiral arms of our galaxy, swirling clouds of gas and dust where new stars are born, and the mysterious black hole that lurks at the galactic center. The hydrogen line is our guide, illuminating the hidden structures of our cosmic neighborhood. The speed of light is the ultimate speed limit in the universe, according to Einstein's theory of relativity. Nothing can travel faster than light. This poses a problem for interstellar communication, as even light takes years to travel between stars. A message sent at the speed of light would take four years to reach our nearest stellar neighbor, Proxima Centauri, and thousands of years to reach other star systems. This leads us to a paradox. If we want to communicate with civilizations beyond our solar system, we need to find a way to send messages faster than light. But according to our current understanding of physics, this seems impossible. It's like trying to send a message on a piece of paper by throwing it faster than the speed of sound. No matter how hard you throw, the paper will never break the sound barrier. Similarly, it seems impossible to send information faster than light. Section 5, When Science Fiction Meets Science Fact Science fiction has long explored the possibilities of faster-than-light communication, often using the hydrogen line as a conduit for interstellar messages. In these universes, advanced civilizations have developed technologies that allow them to manipulate the hydrogen line, encoding messages on its waves and sending them across the galaxy. One of the most famous examples is the subspace communication used in Star Trek. While the science behind subspace communication is never fully explained, it's implied to involve manipulating the fabric of space-time, allowing for faster-than-light travel and communication. These concepts are being studied. They highlight our fascination with the possibility of breaking the cosmic speed limit and connecting with other intelligent life in the universe. 
Section 6, The Starship Enterprise and Beyond. In the Star Trek universe, the Starship Enterprise and other starships use subspace communication to stay in touch with Starfleet Command across vast distances. They send messages that travel faster than light, allowing for near instantaneous communication across the galaxy. These notions raise intriguing questions about the nature of space and time. Could there be hidden dimensions or shortcuts in the fabric of space-time that we could one day exploit for faster-than-light communication? It's important to remember that science fiction often serves as a testing ground for new ideas, and we will soon find that many of the stuff of fiction have been created and suppressed. While faster-than-light communication may seem impossible today, it's not necessarily impossible forever, and it may already be reality that will soon be revealed. Section 7. The Challenges of Interstellar Whispers While the hydrogen line offers a tantalizing possibility for interstellar communication, there are significant challenges to overcome. The signals we receive from distant hydrogen clouds are incredibly faint, like whispers from across the cosmos. Detecting these faint whispers requires incredibly sensitive radio telescopes, and even then, the signal can be easily drowned out by other sources of radio noise, both natural and man-made. Think of trying to have a conversation at a rock concert. It's almost impossible to hear anything over the noise. Moreover, sending a message on the hydrogen line would require enormous amounts of energy. It's like trying to shout across a vast canyon. You need a very loud voice to be heard. Section 8. Quantum Entanglement, A Bridge Across the Cosmos One of the most intriguing possibilities for faster-than-light communication comes from the strange world of quantum mechanics. Quantum entanglement is a phenomenon where two particles become linked, even when separated by vast distances. When you change the state of one entangled particle, the other particle instantly changes its state, regardless of the distance between them. It's as if the two particles are connected by an invisible thread, allowing them to communicate instantaneously. Could we one day harness quantum entanglement to send messages faster than light? While it's still a theoretical possibility, it has captured the imagination of scientists and science fiction writers alike. Section 9, The Future of FTL Communication, A Universe of Possibilities The search for faster-than-light communication is ultimately a search for new physics, a quest to understand the universe at its most fundamental level. While the challenges are significant, so are the potential rewards. Imagine a future where we can communicate with distant civilizations, share knowledge and culture, and explore the universe together. The hydrogen line, with its faint whispers of hydrogen from across the cosmos, offers one intriguing possibility. Quantum entanglement, with its mind-bending connections between distant particles, offers another. And there may be other, even more exotic possibilities waiting to be discovered. The universe is full of mysteries and the quest to unravel them is one of humanity's greatest adventures. Faster than light communication, once the realm of science fiction, may one day soon become a scientific reality, opening up a universe of possibilities. Section 10, The Hydrogen Line, A Legacy of Discovery. The hydrogen line, discovered in 1951, has already revolutionized our understanding of the universe. It has allowed us to map the Milky Way, study the birth and death of stars, and probe the mysteries of black holes but its most profound legacy may lie in its potential to connect us with other intelligent life in the cosmos. The search for extraterrestrial intelligence, or SETI, has long focused on searching for radio signals from other civilizations, just like in the movie titled simply, Contact. The hydrogen line, as the most ubiquitous radio signal in the universe, is a natural place to look. It's like tuning our radio to the cosmic frequency of communication. The official word is that we haven't heard any alien whispers yet, but I believe we are far beyond waiting for whispers from extraterrestrials. I think they are helping us evolve to higher levels of existence. Section 11. Our place in the cosmic chorus. The universe is a symphony of light and sound, 
a cosmic chorus of energy and matter, from the faintest whispers of hydrogen to the blinding light of distant stars, the universe is constantly communicating with itself. We humans are just beginning to listen to this cosmic symphony, to decipher the language of the cosmos and connect with higher beings. And as we listen, we learn more about our place in the universe and our undeniable connection to everything around us. The search for faster-than-light communication is ultimately a search for ourselves, a quest to understand our place in the grand scheme of things. It's a journey that will take us to the farthest reaches of space and time, while simultaneously taking us to the deepest depth of our souls. I hope that everyone watching this begins to understand that our world is about to change in ways that most can't imagine. Cleanse your soul. Quiet your spirit and live in expectation rather than desperation. The vibration you emit creates your future and affects the collective state of the world, so make it good. Wake up each morning and give thanks for tomorrow as if it's already happened.